Hey guys, Silent CL here. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Cafe Mix with me. So you can tell from the daily stamp login, uh, it's different because the well, the lady that helps run our cafe isn't there, but is replaced by a shiny Celebi. So in commemorations with the latest Pokemon movie, which is Pokemon Coco, um, that's hitting cinemas in Japan very soon. If I'm not wrong, I think it's today. <laughs> um, I might be wrong. If I'm wrong, you can see words pop out on the screen. And yeah, as of today that I'm recording, 23rd of December 2020, this is the very official first day of the stamp collection for Shiny Celebi. So you don't really have to play any special kind of event to obtain Shiny Celebi. You just have to log in daily. For the next 10 days, at least. <laughs> well, you basically just to log in 3 days straight, as you can tell, Shiny Celebi is on the third stamp. Um, if, you t if you log in 3 days within the next 10 days, you will get Shiny Celebi straight away. But of course, if you want to gain those yummy tarts, um, you have to log in every day for the next 10 days. So yes. Um, just be faithful with logging in, even if you don't play, I'm sure you should be logging in to play at least the party invitations, you know, just to help your team to gain stars to unlock the current event Pokemon. So if you have not been doing that, I'm not too sure what you're doing here with my videos, but hmm, who knows, I still appreciate the views anyways. Alright, let's dive in. Uh, oh, we still have our daily stand board. Cool. Okay. So aside from Shiny Celebi, um, the Pokemon website actually introduced uh, 2021's first raid event Pokemon, or rather the first event Pokemon, um, which is Chansey. That's pretty exciting. <laughs> So look forward to Chansey joining the cafe in the future, but of course you have to work hard right now with Lucario. So let's claim the rewards first that our team has been working hard to get. Which doesn't seem to be very far, considering that the first place only has like 58 stars. That's kind of worrying. <laughs> okay, let's just claim as much as we can. Wow, you actually made it to level 4. That's good. And... Yep, as expected, we're gonna stop here. So, uh, let's see, is it still 9 levels? Yep, 9 levels to get Lucario. So, we still got a bit of a ways to work hard. Oh, wow, I'm actually not that far from 3rd place. Oh boy, <laughs> that's not a good sign. Alright, so let's do the party thingy. Okay, um, we have both Meowth and Stoutland, so let's refresh to see if we can get more stars for Pokemon we have not gotten yet. So, sadly to say, nothing on the free refresh, so let's just stick with these two. Alright, and go with Squirtle. Hmm. Oh boy, look at all the olives. This is not good. So since the canisters are coated at this point in time, let's just keep them coated and let's just get Squirtle's skill. Alright, maybe we should start popping a few of the vegetable crates as well. Okay, let's get more skill. It would be better to just destroy everything in one go. Alright, now that we have two of them, let's do this. Alright, fantastic. So let's gather as much icons as possible. Set the canisters free. Of course, don't forget to push all the milk stuff in. We do seem to have one olive still remaining, so that's not good. Alright, let's push them in. Okay. We do have the skills. So let's do this. Let's throw everything in the way. Ok, 
Okay, there is that olive that's still remaining, so that's kind of worrying. Where is the last cafe? There we go. Okay. We do need to get fruits and points. So let's do that. And the olive is the last thing. Simple as that. As long as you do things systematically, you should be fine. No. Even though you don't make it true, well, it's still the first party invite. You can still use stars. You know, to retry the level. So no worries. It's it's always the second one that you have to worry about. <laughs> Alright. So let's go with Blossom. So yeah, pretty exciting that we are getting our first shiny Pokemon in Pokemon Cafe mix. I wonder how many other shinies they're going to introduce in the future. Okay, let's gather all the blossoms. There we go. And let's destroy the top row first so we can get things flowing in. It's a lot of meow. Alright. Let's gather all the marshmallows. And followed by this. Hopefully the megaphone summon out can help to destroy nothing. God dang it. <laughs> Alright, so let's get rid of the marshmallows. Okay. Fantastic. So, yep. Yeah. Oh. Oh, come on. Are you kidding? Both of the skills had to go to the other side? This is horrible. Okay, we only have one move remaining, so let's just push all the popcorn kernels together. Ah, that was kind of a lucky break there. Good thing they're all in a position and you can just easily shift them together. If not, we probably have to pay that 900A confi. Oh! <laughs> Alright. Now that's done. Let's move on with the usual 10 stages. Alright. Audino, you're needed. Ooh. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so I guess it's beneficial to settle the olives first since the chocolates are kind of coated already so we might as well make use of the coating to keep them coated still if that makes sense okay let's get another of the skill Right. Seems like we got most of the others. Okay, one more to go. So let's do this. Nope. Almost missed. Okay, let's power up Ordino's skill. Make sure the green circle is as close to the chocolates as possible. Yeah. Okay, that didn't turn out as I wanted. I thought I could get rid of more. Oh well. Alright, here we go again. One more try. Hopefully this time with some luck, we'll destroy the remaining two. And... Well, one left. That's... That's okay. I expected worst. <laughs> like, not a single one destroyed. Not too bad. Alright, moving along. Hopefully to see some friendship bonus. Um, maybe on the level that has two stars? Hmm? Ooh. So our fruit cans. Okay. Let's try to get Meowth skill as quickly as we can. Don't... Oh, we do have egg baskets, so let's get eggs at the same time. Alright, let's set these three so that they can merge together. Alright. Let's 
try not to get them to move around too much. Okay, Bubble Souls. We need the eggs. There we go. Okay. One thing at a time. Can we get them to join? Yes, we can. Eggs, eggs, eggs. There seems to be a flow, a pattern to destroy the fruit canisters, you know, so that we can benefit from the fall of the items to merge together. And one last Meowth skill will do the trick. Make sure we cover all the areas required. And done! Simple as that! Like me some breakfast at this time. Although it's like 11 pm. <laughs> but it's never too late in the day to have a good breakfast. Alright. Scotto. I always love cafes that have like all day breakfast menus. They they just bring a smile to my face whenever I can have breakfast like midnight. <laughs> 11 p.m. like now, oh, bacon and eggs, never go wrong. Well, it depends on how you want your eggs cooked. All right, so let's try this stage. Um, seems like the stage is set up in a way that Scoto's skill will benefit us. All right, so the problem here is the pumpkins. Maybe let's push them into this pit here, um, so we can benefit. You know, destroying everything at one go. Okay, let's dig up space. Alright, where's the last pumpkin? Oh, keep missing it. Alright, let's set it free. Okay, let's push them all together if possible. Oh! Wow, that's rather unfortunate, but okay, it's okay. We just need one more skill of Squirtles. And there we go. Can we push this in? Yep. Power it up. And let's do it again. Okay. So let's get another skill. Destroy as many of the Wood Queens as possible. Two tiny ones especially. Hmm, that was rather unfortunate. Okay, if we destroyed the tiny one, we could have ended the stage straight away. Oh well, we had to use up all the moves, but we still cleared the stage. That's all we need. Alright, we have Blossom as our next guest. Triple four. Hmm. Uh oh. Okay. Um, there are a lot of Waba Fats going on, so let's make use of Waba Fats now. Clear all the caramels. Okay, we missed a few, but that's fine. It's bound to happen. Alright, we probably need one more, you know, so we can destroy all the things at one go. Okay, lots of Ordinos, let's use them. Alright, there we go, so we have cleared all the caramels. Let's just get- Oh, we missed the chestnut! It was blinking, and I shifted a bit. Oh, that was just really unfortunate, but that's okay. Okay, let's- get all the tomato bottles together we don't need the skill we just need our megaphone yep oh we still need score okay let's just use all the rubber fats we can and done not too difficult so we just needed one 
powered up skill to settle everything generally if we didn't miss that last chestnut. <laughs> oh well. Okay. What about that now? So far, no friendship bonuses. That's kind of sad, considering that we are doing a raid event. Okay, let's go with Waba Fats. Oh no, look at what is needed. Okay, Genos. Okay, let's get rid of the two popcorns that are currently red. There we go. And Genos. Oh, looks again. So annoying. What about that? Okay. One problem after another. So many colors. Hmm. Okay. So let's power up Wabafet's skill. We do technically need to, to use a bunch of megaphones. So eventually we have to use Wabafet's skill. Okay, so we do need to clear one more popcorn. We got the score cleared. Okay, let's do this as close as to the kernel as possible. Hopefully the megaphone points into the correct direction. Oh my god, that is... Oh, 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 that worked out fine. <laughs> Talk about luck. I was kind of depressed for a moment. <laughs> oh well. I guess Lady Luck has not given up on us. Hmm. Stoutland's next. Okay. A big boy requires another big boy to serve. Oh boy. Okay, so as usual, let's go with the main Pokemon to get the skill going. And of course, let's destroy as much honey as we can while doing so. And we have egg baskets as well. Remember to do that. Okay, we do need to destroy this honey in the bottom. Oh no, we missed our chance. Okay, let's go. There's a reason why we need to destroy it, so um, so we can actually have a reach with the skill. There we go. So all the sugar cubes are settled, so it's just honey. Mm -hmm. And the score with some eggs. Yeah, the egg baskets. Almost done with the eggs. And the honey is completed. Now it's only the score. Alright, that did it. Not too difficult. So for this level you just gotta concentrate on the on evenly destructive powers of the icons. Um, make sure you clear that middle section of honey so you can use the skill to its full extent and we should be fine oh friendship bonus finally oh but we're so close to the 10th level why couldn't they have given it us you know on the two star stage <laughs> oh well Okay, so we got to do this systematically because Barbosa's skill is an X, um, well, X shape destroying skill. So the chocolates are definitely in a position to destroy. There we go. So let's destroy the chocolates first. This we should have. Uh, we can destroy the chocolates first. Well, technically, it's just gonna roll all the tomatoes in. Let's boop the tomatoes. Yeah, all the tomatoes are in, so we just need a bubble sauce. 
Alright, not enough bubble sauce, so let's get rid of the other icons first. It looks like we actually have more than enough bubble sauce to clear the stage. Oh well! What's done is done. Could have ended one step faster. But still, clearing the stage is the key importance, especially with that friendship bonus around. Lovely three stars. Mm. Still far away from the next level though. Let's work a bit harder. Jiggy puff. It's all up to you. Hmm. Okay. I've got some good creamy shoes. Oh, Link 30. Okay. So we need Wobbuffet's skill to be level 2. Okay, we've got problems with fruit cans as well. That's not good. Okay. So for the meantime, let's try to get all the whipped creams out. Okay, so the right side is the most efficient way to get the whipped creams out. Hopefully... Oh wait! This is Jigglypuff! I was thinking we're using Wobbuffet! Oh no! Okay, we've got all the whipped creams out now. Hmm. Now the only problem is the dirty combo. I mean the dirty... Link! Hmm. Okay, let's get rid of the stuff here first. Hopefully change the majority of the Pokemon icons to Jigglypuff. Yeah, so we can continue the flow of, you know. Okay, let's destroy the Wooking and the Hook Hand here. Now the only problem is the... yeah, we've got a big problem. Hmm. Seems like we might not make it. Yeah. First retry of the day. Okay, now that I reminded myself that it's Jigglypuff, that is the skill, not Baba Fat. <laughs> let's try not to mess up. So let's do this. Alright. Okay. Let's go with Starly. Okay, we got Boba Fett. If we can push all the whipped creams together, that is gonna benefit us in the long run. Alright, with that. All the whip creams are out. Now it's just getting rid of them. Okay, the link 30 is gone. This side with the most whip creams that are huge. Okay. Alright, let's push this one down if possible. Nope. Alright. We can get rid of this whole bunch here with the skill. And we just need a megaphone to destroy the last one at the top. And we are golden! Done! Simple as that. We failed the first round because we weren't paying attention. <laughs> so always remember the type of skill that you have for the level. Maybe just spending a split second to look at the bottom left of the screen and you'll realize what's going on. <laughs> Okay, let's move on, but lost him again. Hmm, a lot of things are being bubbled up, so that's not good. Okay, let's get a Blossom icons. Get the skill going. Oh, that wasn't enough. Okay, release as many as possible, if you can. Alright, 
pushing the canisters and all that good stuff together so that they can merge not looking good. Hmm. Okay. We've got a problem. Oh no, the canister. Oh no, we're wasting a whole bunch of stuff. At least we're getting the megaphone counts clear. Okay. Only problem is the canister. Okay, okay. Can we move this together? Oh no! Oh, this is unfortunate. We're gonna have to retry! Oh! I just had to jinx myself. Okay, let's do this again. The key point is to make sure we don't mess up with the milk canisters. Oh boy. Okay. So let's just try to get them mixed together. Okay. Seems good. Alright, pushing them in. Okay, so all of them on the same lane right now. Looks good, looks good. Okay, we're gonna help destroy as many marshmallows as possible. Okay, that's that's good. Decent stuff going on right now. Alright, those will join automatically. Fantastic. So let's just do this. We need to clear megaphones requirements as well. Ooh, ooh. Nice. Now all we have to do is just get rid of this. Why was it so difficult the first time? <laughs> but we did it. We cleared the level. And, you know, as long as we pay close attention to where the, the milk bottle, I mean, the, whatever you want to call it, and the, and the mixing flask, well, I think you'll be fine. You know, a bit of luck and placement does. Well, it's mean. Oh my goodness! Are we actually getting friendship bonus on the two star level? Oh! Oh! <laughs> Us and it shall be given! Holy crap! Alright, let's claim our gifts first. Fantastic. Oh my goodness! We're gonna get our six stars! Well, that is if we actually clear it in <laughs> one try. Uh, well, we could always use the 900 acorns, but you know, it's always nice to not use it. Oh no, this looks a bit difficult. Okay, so Munchlax, hmm, seems like we're gonna need a lot of Munchlax skills, so let's just power them up. And of course, let's try to clear the Mayonis stuff, because, well... Okay, come on, megaphones. Oh, oh, that's not good. Okay, so while we have nothing else to destroy, we might as well just have a few chocolate bars along the way. Oh man, we're having really bad luck with the placing positions of the megaphones. Okay, let's go in. Set up some of these neons free and some eggs as well. Okay, destroy the remaining two. Not that we need to, but you know, it's always nice to be a bit more spacious with our movements. All 
Alright. Okay, let's hit all snubble. Let's go snubble. Okay, we have a problem. Yep. The placements of the chocolates and the tomato bottles are just not in our favor. Seems like we're gonna have to do this. That six stars is gonna be so worth it when compared to 900 ac uh, acorns. Okay, so let's push these closer. Come on, come on. There we go. Whew. Use them if you need to. And acorns are there to help you out, especially when it comes to these kind of events where you need to grind stars. Don't waste the friendship bonus away. Ooh, look at that. Beautiful. And we got Buizo at level 2. Oh. Seems like we're gonna add something to the cafe. Ooh, strawberries. That actually looks good! Darn! Alright, so that's it for this episode 10 stages as usual. I'm gonna try to put out another episode soon. Uh, of course, um, definitely within the time period to get Shiny Celebi as well. And yes, oh, what's this? Oh, hello my big friend, you're next. Okay, so yeah, things have been pretty exciting. It seems like the developers have been trying to change things up for Pokemon Cafe Mix as well because they realize like, um, you know, certain things aren't attracting newer players to the game. So that's kind of looking towards a brighter future for the game, I suppose. And as usual guys, if you guys enjoyed or learned something about these 10 stages that we handled let me know in the comments down below and of course you know leaving a like to this video also helps out the channel as always and it also helps me out to know whether you guys like the content or not and if you're bright if you guys bright what, what, what was i saying <laughs> if you guys and girls um are new to the channel make sure you hit that subscribe button for more content just like this or whatever um, that i may produce that might your interest you know just because yeah, aside from pokemon maybe you are fans of other things that i'm a fan of and you might enjoy the content that i put out so until then guys i'll see you guys in the next episode very soon bye